waste my time on my hair. I just want to be there at the beach like a mermaid swimming in the sea. Do, do, do. I don't live near the sea. But there's a lake. Hey, want to make some do-it-yourself hair care products with me? Yeah, you do. So, last time I was in your video space making some dry shampoo. How easy is that? I made dry shampoo, I just put it in my hair, and I'm ready and fresh, and I smell a little bit like chocolate and a little bit like lavender. But now, I want to add a little bit of, like, body to my hair. So, I'm going to show you today how to make a mermaid, mermaid, sea salt, beach spray. We're going to be mermaids. What you need to make this spray pretty straight ahead. I mean, nothing is as easy as that dry shampoo. It's like three ingredients, but uh, here we go. This is the mermaid spray ingredients. What you need to make this product is some aloe vera gel. You need some coconut oil, sea salt, lavender oil. You can use other oils too. I'm choosing lavender. Some warm water and a spray bottle. That's it, that's all you need. I'm gonna show you how to make it right now. easy as that. Super awesome, delicious smelling sea salt spray. Come check it out. And just give yourself a mist over. As it dries, it's really holding a lot of body and I like this. I like having big hair. I like having big hippie waves. Which way to the beach? And that's it. That's your mermaid sea salt spray. And if you're anything like me and you got a few flyaways, I think my next video can help you with that. We've got some coconut Buddha curl cream coming up. So go ahead and download the recipe for the mermaid sea salt spray and you can make your own at home.